All right, we want to calculate the solubility of lead 2 iodide and 0.5 molar potassium iodide, given a KSP of 7.9 times 10 to the negative 9th. All right, the KSP of lead 2 iodide, PP2 plus, I is a minus 1, so this would be squared. All right, and we want to plug in our molar solubilities here. So for every lead iodide, there would be one lead, but two iodides. And in this case, we're going to offset the iodide with a 0 0.50 plus 2s squared. And we are going to try an assumption here. And the assumption is that the s is very, very small, mainly because of the KSP. And therefore, the 0.5 is huge by comparison. Mainly, we do that because it makes the math a heck of a lot easier. Divided by 0.5 squared we'd have an S of 3.16 times 10 to the negative eighth, or S equals 3.2 times 10 to the negative eighth. And that is significantly smaller than that 0.5, so that would be a safe assumption to make. Now, if you happen to have the graphing calculator, you can solve this um, slightly more steps, but it's actually slightly more accurate. Don't think it'll make much difference in this case, though. So I'm putting x's instead of the s's. And then minus 7.9 times 10 to the negative ninth. And graph it. And then calculate a 0 that is larger than 0. And I just need to move up this until I see that it's in positive range, and then start the guess at zero, and we get the exact same number, 3.2 times 10 negative eighth, uh, which is definitely expected with how small that is compared to the 0.5.